Hey guys, so for sample 12, um, you guys are supposed to choose one of these variations and draft the pattern yourself with no help. Um, and again, it's not to get the right answer. It's okay if we got the wrong one. We're just kind of working through this. Um, just like really, like I don't know, muscle powering our brains here, trying to think through this. Um, and then we could share with each other and see what we think. Um, I'm gonna try design one. Um, I, you know, and you guys might have a different suggestion for how to do it. This video is really not meant for you to follow along step by step. I just thought um, I'd give it a shot and just go ahead and try it. Um, okay, here we go. So right at the bat, I see the neck, you know, is obviously different and the sleeves. So I'm not making a huge val valiant effort to copy it exactly, but I'm just gonna get rid of the armhole sleeve and kind of make that straight. And I'm probably gonna do that with the neckline as well. I don't wanna delete it, but maybe if I bring it up higher and then, oh gosh, let's see what if I right click, oh, if I pick you, right click, and then, um, what happens if I hit delete? Oh yeah, that's fine. <laughs> um, okay. Let's see here. So I, I have my princess pattern that I started with. So my princess seam, obviously it's kind of about like the bust area kind of curves over to center front. Oh, so I lost my center front. I just realized, you know what? I'm going to hit command Z to edit undo that guy. I just want this line straight. Is that too much to ask for people? Let me zoom in. You know what, just to make my life easier, I think I am going to unfold this thing. So I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna say remove my linked editing and then I'm just gonna delete one half of it. There we go, so that way I'm just working on one. Um, okay, so this guy, I would like it to be a straight line. Is that easier said than done? Delete all curve points, yeah, bingo. I right clicked, got rid of it. I just want it to be a straight line for right now. Um, maybe, should, maybe I will just get rid of it and make the whole thing straight. Okay, now what? Let's see here. Okay, so I want to move a curve line kind of right here. So maybe I'll get my internal tool draw line and just kind of draw a curved shape that I think looks nice. I'm gonna hold Command. Um, I did a double click to stop. Okay, I guess that's nice. Um, so let's see here. Is that going to look good? I don't quite know for sure yet. These two need to be connected. Um, let's see here. Oopsies. So I think what I will do is I will select my internal line I just drew with um, my Z tool. I'm gonna right click. I'm just gonna make sure it's actually Extend it to the pattern outline, and then now I will say uh, cut and sew. Do I want to do cut and sew? I think I want to do cut and sew. I can always not do cut and sew later. You know, here's something I've never really done before: is merge two pieces that are different lengths. I wonder if they will let me, if it's going to yell at me. <laughs> let me see. Okay, I'm going to click you. I'm going to click you. I'm going to right click merge. Oh, it did it! Fabulous. Cool. Okay, now we want this piece way longer. Hmm, am I capable of doing this? Also, I don't like how pointy this thing is. I'm gonna get this little tool here, smooth curve, and just see if I can smooth that bad boy out. That'll make me a little happier, I think. Okay, um, okay. so if I was doing this um, by hand, I'd probably cut some slash lines here and I'd cut them two but not through, like, like even like this purple one. I'd start here cutting and then two and not through this line and then spread it all open. Oh, the other way though, because I, I want the big part in here. So I'm sorry, I take that back. I would cut here, cut, 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 and then not all the way here and spread it open. So it would make like a crazy shape. Um, let's see if I can use the fullness tool to do that. I'm still kind of new at the fullness tool. Hmm. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it or not. Okay. So, you know, I'm going to delete this thing. Um, maybe I'll just copy this guy real quick. Copy and paste it, um, to practice on it. Okay. So 
the fullness tool, if you did watch the other video I made, I'll just do this again real quick. I'm draw a little square. I'm still kind of getting new to this fullness tool. Um, I mean, I guess I could manually draw internal lines and cut them and separate them and just like move them and retrace it, but I kind of want to get used to these internal tools or this uh, fullness tool. So fullness line, I mean, let's say I want you to be my fullness line. Now it wants me to select the slash line, which I, in this case, I just did the other side. Okay, cancel. Okay, let me do that one more time. Da, 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 da. Click, click. Okay, and then you can just start, you know, making it and see how it gets like bigger. You can do both sides if you wanted to. Um, okay. So I guess I'm kind of confused. Is this my fullness line? I think this is my fullness line. Click. And then are you my slash line? Well, I don't really know. Okay, well, let's see what happens. I don't really know if this is going to work or not. Okay. Hmm. I don't know. Well, I guess it's good because this is still staying 21 inches. It's not changing. And this one, it is getting bigger. So maybe that is correct. I don't know how much bigger to make. I'm just going crazy. I'm like, Okay, I moved it 10 inches apparently. We'll say okay. Well, that's a pretty pattern piece. Um, okay. So let's see um, what this looks like, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna take you, delete, you, delete. Um, how about if I say, huh, I'm gonna pick you and right click and unfold with, with sewing. And then I'm gonna say you, right click, um, symmetric pattern with sewing. I guess put you over here. Okay. And then the only thing we need to do is sew the seam to itself. So let's see if we can handle that. I'll just click, oh, click, click. So that'll get sewn together. Okay, her head is totally gonna get in the way. Woohoo! Let's see if this actually worked. Um, this might be a disaster. Thought her head might get in the way. Okay, come on, guys, down here. I'm trying to like pull this off of her. Um, yeah. Okay, so I have an idea. We are going to select you. Right click, select you, select you, I'm going to right click and we're going to say reset 3D arrangement. Cool. Okay. Something else needed to get sewn. What else was it? Uh, let's show our sewing tools. Yeah, this bottom part's not sewn together, is it? Let me see here. Yeah, no, it's not. Okay, good to know. So, um, am I wrong or am I right? What's going on here? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is kind of a mess. Um, oh boy. Why don't I select all these pieces? You can right click and say reset 2D. There we are. Okay. So, let's see here. Sewing, I guess. Let's get this guy. Click, mm. click, yes, perfect. Okay, that's good. Um, okay, I'm gonna open up her arrangement things. Um, I'm not sure what's going on here. Let's see, I'm pick you guys. Do you need to set 2D arrangement? I think that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, there we go. I'm just going to move it out of my way. Yeah, it's like a belt right here. Click. Oh, just kidding. Click. There we are. Um, and then you just move it out of the way so I can see what the heck I'm trying to do. Mm, this, is a, this is a weird piece. So this, the arrangement thing might not work really well. Hmm. I'm not sure what to do about that. 
And then what's going on here? Ooh, I don't want anything sewn on the back. Maybe that's causing some issues, isn't it? Uh-huh, okay. What is going on here? Right click, reset. Darts are okay. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm going to get rid of this stitch right here. Where is it? I don't know what I just deleted. Oh, gosh. I'm going to do that. <laughs> Let's zoom in. It'll cause less trouble. Okay. You. Delete. You. Delete. Okay. That's better. Oh, uh, what is this weird green one? Delete. Delete. Okay. I think I did it. That's cool. Uh, what the heck? I don't even know what to do with you right now. I'm just going to delete you. Okay. Right. That's better. Now, I didn't really do anything with the back. I kind of ignored it. Uh, that's probably problematic. <laughs> so, let's just see what it looks like right now. The mess I got myself into. All right, so yeah, she obviously is looking kind of cool, but we need some shoulder seams sewn up, don't we? So let's pause it and let's look. Okay, so that's my center. So maybe you should be sewn to the shoulder seam somewhere. So I'm gonna say click, click. Let's go find our back piece. Oh, why does it be overlapping? Ah. Okay, hold on. Get over here. Get over here. Okay, let's try again. Um, sewing. Click, click. Option, pan over, click, click. Okay, so I guess I should probably get rid of this, huh? the back mm -hmm. so what if i say you're out you're oh what, are, what happens if i say you're out and just leave it a v-neck <laughs> why not is it weird we got okay i did bad with my stitching because i'm crossing it funky okay no worries i can fix that so let's go back here see line delete Okay. Um, let's do you and you. Is that you? I don't know. Or is it you? Okay. Click. Click. Oh, I probably should have gone all the way up there. Whatever. Okay, what's going to happen? Okay, so I guess she needs longer sleeves. Um, let's click it. What is going on? Is that like, ooh, right here. We want that longer. And then, are you the armhole? Is that what's happening in here? I don't know. Yeah. So it's like this little line should be longer. Okay, so what if I just went rogue and pulled it? It's probably gonna mess up my shoulder seaming. Because now the back needs to be longer, I think. So the back, I just click the back to kind of get a blue dot on it. Let's try again. Um, should I just click and drag all crazy style like I just did? Oh, remember the other one how I got rid of that curve? Optimize. It, delete all curve points. There we are. I should really trim up and make sure that they're the same length, right? Hmm. 
Where is this? Hmm. Maybe I do need to, oh, actually I just pulled out. Come on, there we go. There you go. See how cute you are? Okay. I'm just fitting a little funny. There we go. See, you fit great. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. Okay. Let's get it on here a little bit more. A little tight there, hey? Well, isn't she lovely? Um, anyways, you kind of get the gist. Um, I think, you know, this part's obviously a little big. Not sure what's going on there, so go back here. But I got the little shearing thing, like how they wanted. Um, it just looks like we have more shearing in the middle instead of on the side. It's just a shearing on the side. <laughs> so in that case, let's go look at this pattern piece. What a crazy pattern piece. Does anyone else's head hurt? I think we need to make this guy longer. Um, hmm. Interesting. So if I click right here, yeah, I'll click right here. This is, I don't know if this was really a good idea. I probably should be using my fullness tool, right? I kind of feel like I want to use my fullness tool, but I didn't. What happens if I just did that? Any sharing? No. No. Hmm, I just kind of stretched my fabric, funky. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. That's weird. What if I make this short? <laughs> it's funny with the avatar, you just like throw measurements away. You're like, let me just try this and this. I don't think making it short was a very good idea. Okay. Remember when I said I wanted to play with my fullness tool? I'm hitting Command Z a few times. I want this point to go back up. There it goes. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, so my fullness line. Let's say I want this guy to go long. And then what's my slash line? Maybe it's this. So let's try the fullness thing. Who knows if it's going to work? I certainly don't. <laughs> Click. Click, and then I'll try this one. Click, click. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, oh, it's going that way. All right. I'm just, I'm going so crazy here. How far should I go? <laughs> okay. Ah, that's annoying. Are you going to do it to the other side? I think they're mirrors. It should. Okay, good. Few. Um, okay. What's this look like? Mmm, that's lovely. Get back on here. Get back on. <laughs> okay. Z. Command Z. Command Z. Command Z. Okay. Oh, no. Come I wanted to do that last thing again. Hmm. Maybe I just tuck it too far. What if I hit Command Z right now? Everyone's kind of happy. Okay, cool. Pause. Um... Actually, I'm going to pull this on her. I want this to fit her a little bit better. Okay, we got something going on. Okay, I want to do that fullness thing again. Maybe I won't do so much. What if I do, what is this? Where are you? Oh, okay. Maybe I'll just do you to you. From here to here. And let's do it by end. Yeah, so it goes the other way. Let's give it like five inches, or I guess that's about six inches. Let's check it six. Okay. What's gonna happen? What do you think? Yeah, okay. More? <laughs> more? Uh, yeah. Okay, so let's do more fullness. I'm gonna say on you. You to be full. I guess you're the side seam, right? I'm not even sure. Okay. 
do you want the fullness to go the other way? Um, I only did like six last time. Yeah, the same, I'm doing closer to seven. <gasps> uh oh, something didn't work. Click on the start and consult the fullness line. I want you to be full. And I guess I'll slash you. And end. Cool. Okay. Oh, we're getting more of the sharing. Should I do more? Why am I not really getting a lot around the best? Are we kind of getting somewhere? Hmm. Okay, so anyways, <laughs> I guess I can keep playing with her. Um, maybe her sites. But you get the idea. I didn't want to do this for you. I don't really want you to follow me exactly, um, but I just want to play around with it. I want you guys to think and try and see what happens and just, it's a puzzle, you know, puzzles are fun, right? Um, and let's just talk about it and learn from each other, okay? All right, looking forward to seeing how you guys do.